Hello, it's wonderful to connect again today. Welcome to my channel. My name is Michael Hutchinson, Hutch for short. And today I'm going to jump into using a powerful alternative chat GBT called Abacus AI. Abacus AI gives you a lot of bang for your buck. Let's dive in. So let's jump over to Abacus and take a look. Abacus gives you a lot of resources and I'm going to use it today to scope out some blog ideas and topics. Uh, Abacus can connect to a number of LLMs and image creators. So I gave it a prompt and I'm looking at some blog topic ideas for a local IT company. And this is what has given me. So now I've given it another prompt. I want it to expand on the topic ideas 3, 7, 8, 11, and 15, because I think they're most pertinent to the topics that I want to cover. And I'm going to scroll through these. And what I'm hoping to do is create a month or six weeks worth of content resources for this particular company. Now what I want to do is create some eye-catching visuals so not only can i get the blog topic content and i want some visuals to go along with the blog so that it really makes it pop i'm going to give it very specific information about what the the visuals that i want are and their sizing so i want it to be 1200 pixels by 550 or 600 pixels and we will see what it can create although these visuals are okay i'm not really happy with them so i'm going to jump over to what's called deep agent which is uh, another part of abacus that allows you to create code, visuals, images, video. And I'm gonna jump over to Deep Agent and give it some different prompts. Let's see how that goes. So I wasn't thrilled with the outcome before. So using Deep Agent within Abacus, I'm gonna give it a new prompt and see how it gets on with my images this time. The other ones weren't bad, but I think that we can improve on the output. So I'm gonna ask it to create stunning visuals for my blog posts and I'm gonna paste in the titles and then we'll hit run and see what it comes up with. Then goes through another step to ask me if I want particular style preferences, colors, themes, uh, dimensions, and so on and so forth. So I'm gonna give it a bit more information. Uh, I'm gonna say modern illustrations, no text, because these kind of image creation platforms, the AI image creation platforms don't seem to do very well with text. And I want it to be electric, not electric and vibrant. And uh, I want it to use colors like blue, green, and orange. Be how it gets on with that. So looking at how Deep Agent processed my request this time, done a very nice job. If I click through some of the images, they're much more in line with what I was hoping for. It mostly followed my color prompts. There is an image that does include a great deal of pink, but I can always just redo that one. And it created a, an image for each blog post. The main challenge we will see is that these images are a very large file size. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put in one more prompt where I ask it to resize the images to make them below 600k as some of them are 4 meg and above which is not suitable for my website so after i made the prompt for it to optimize my images it came back and said here are the images and they are 46 percent small and 90 percent smaller so i'm going to click and download the optimized images so that i can take a look at them and see if they're still of high quality enough to use for my blog post but not a huge file size any longer so if i pull over my downloads here and i look at the zip file it downloaded for me of all the optimized images and open those up you can see that these are still great quality but they are about a fifth, an eighth to a fifth of the size. Perfect for me to use on my blog. So you can see that Abacus AI is a powerful tool. It has many other use cases that I did not go into today. Abacus AI is a powerful tool and I was simply scratching the surface. For $10 a month, you even get access to ChatGPT Pro. So you get a lot of bang for your buck. It also connects to a number of image creators, video creators, code creators, and other LLM agents. So stay tuned, subscribe, and next time we'll go into more depth in the things that you can do with Abacus AI. Bye-bye for now.